everybody, I'm Beth with 50 Plus Beauty, where we women over 50 use great skincare, makeup, and health and fitness to look and feel our best. Today, I'm excited to bring you what I think may be the most darling readers in the world. Readers that help us see tiny print, but also that help us look younger. Now, these readers are from a company called Peepers, and they aren't for old ladies anymore. They're for stylish trendsetters like you and me. And if you're not a subscriber and you're interested in looking and feeling your best in your second half, I hope you'll subscribe to my channel and or give this video a thumbs up. I would really appreciate that. Okay, let's get into this. Readers, and I have to say, I purchased some Peepers readers maybe about six months ago, and I've been wearing them on my channel, you know, whenever I need to read. And whenever I do that, invariably, four or five women after the video say, where did you get those glasses? They are so darn cute. And I have to agree, look how styling these are. And actually, this is one of Oprah's favorite things, this style. And I have a lot of glasses to show you today, and I'll put a little number beside each one, and you might get your pad and paper out because I really think that if you're like me, over 40 with increasingly bad eyes, if you need readers, these are amazing. And first, let me show you what kind of traditional readers look like. So these are kind of the old-fashioned readers that we're all used to. In fact, these really aren't as bad as some of them because I did purchase them. But these are Walmart, Walgreens, little cheap readers, kind of throwaway readers. But, you know, this is how I look, you know, with the readers on. You know, I look very bookish, and, and I, I guess I am bookish, actually. But anyway, that's how those little readers look. I, I think I look about 10 years older with them, especially if you do this bit, a Mrs. Kravitz look. And you've got to be old to remember that. But let's try to upgrade with a little more styling reader. And these are those peepers, and these are ones that I've owned, and I just love them. And I think immediately you go from looking like a little old lady who can't see to kind of looking like you care about fashion and you're still in the game. Before I get into the modeling show, you might want to stick around to the end of this video because I have something about the outfit I'm wearing, which is, I don't know, kind of interesting and I'd like your opinion on it, so do stick around. And before we get into the modeling show, I did want to show you a look at their great website and it's just lovely. And they have a new spring collection with a lot of great glasses. Very fun to look through those. And I do want to say about the readers in general, they are super quality and each of them comes with this great little protective case, which is just wonderful. These readers have a great style. They're very reasonable in price and most of them block blue light. And you may wonder if you really need blue light blocking readers. And here is from their website. It says, do you need blue light lenses? It says blue light emitted from digital devices can cause eye strain and lead to headaches and blurred vision. And basically they're talking about their glasses. They have stylish frames and an anti-reflective coating and they have blue light reducing technology embedded in the lenses and almost all of the readers give you a UV 400 protection which is really really neat. You don't think that the clear glass of those readers could help kind of anti-age your eyes to keep the UV rays off of your eye wrinkles but they really think of everything at Peepers. Okay, I've got quite a few glasses to show you today, and so I'm going to show them to you in kind of a hurried way. But first, I would urge that after you see this video, you click on the link that helps you find your perfect pair. And here is a look at that, and it's a little quiz, and you just click Get Started there. And then it asks you about colors you like, and it also asks you about the shape of glasses that you prefer, so you can enter all that information. And their website will bring up just those glasses which are perfect for you. And I will say that I chose very large glasses as a general rule, but their website has everything for every face shape imaginable, so you might go check it out. Okay, I'm going to be showing you several different readers' styles in this video, and the first one is an Oprah's favorite winner. It was the Oprah's favorite from last year, and I can certainly see why. They're absolutely darling, and they are called Center Stage. And here is a look at them on their website, and as you see, the readers come in blue light or progressive. And what progressive is, it's kind of like bifocals, but a little bit different. And I'll show you a diagram that will explain exactly how this works. The top of the readers is a clear view, so you can see long distance. And then the bottom of the glass, of course, has the reading area, which magnifies whatever you're reading. And the middle portion of the lens is called an intermediate area, which is kind of between the two. And it does take a little bit of getting used to those progressive lenses because they're not the cheap drugstore readers. They're basically bifocal or even trifocal readers. 
And the website did say they take a little bit of getting used to, but you do have a 90-day return policy with them. They're very generous on the return policy because I bet not many people return these glasses, but you really don't have to worry about that. And I got quite a few of the center stage glasses. And as you can see, they won the Oprah's Favorite Award. And then they show you a little model wearing the glasses. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and show you all of these readers. And the Peepers people sent me a ton of different glasses for this video. And I'm mostly going to be showing you larger styles. But again, if you like smaller readers, that's not a problem. If that works better on your face, you can go to the Peepers website and take that quiz and it will bring up just those glasses that will look great on you. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and start some music and I'll show you the first group. And again, I will number them below. So if you'd like to keep notes on the glasses you like best, that may be helpful for you. Okay, this was the last in the group called Center Stage, which was again an Oprah's fave, and I can certainly see why. I think these are some of my very favorite ones. Okay, now let's get into the next group, and I've got just a couple of glasses in each one, so I'll go ahead and start the music, and I'll show you those. Now let's get into the Peeper sunglasses. And with spring and summer coming, it's a great time to go ahead and get yourself a little glasses wardrobe, maybe two or three pairs that you really like. So I'll go ahead and show you those sunglasses. And again, they'll all be linked below.
Okay, that was a look at the Peeper sunglasses. And I mentioned to you at the first of this video that I wanted to show you this outfit because there is a secret in this outfit, which is kind of a funny secret. And let me show you this outfit right now. Okay, this is my outfit of the day. And this is a great Amazon sweater that I love. I now have it in white, this color, and I ordered it in purple. It is a fabulous sweater. And the information about it is down below the video. And here are my favorite straight jeans. They're the Levi's 724 straights. I wear them pretty much every day. I've got a ton of pairs of them. Okay, now this is me without any curves. This is me naturally. As you can tell, I have no butt, and then I really have not much in the way of boobs anymore. But in the next picture, I will show you the addition of butt and boobs, instant curves. And please tell me in the comments section below if you like the nice thin look or if you like me with a little more in the way of curves. Okay, I just wanted you to see a quick pic of me with my new butt contrasted with my skinny butt, which you just saw. But this is how it looks, and I've got some little boob things in here too. And so let me know in the comment section if you like the curvy Beth or the skinny Beth. And also if you'd like me to show you a video about some of the shapewear that I purchased to give us shape if we're too skinny. And again, if you're not yet a member of the 50 Plus Beauty family, I hope you'll subscribe to my channel and or give this video a thumbs up. Okay, I always like to leave you with a little thought for the day, and I've decided not to read from a positive thinking card today. I got up this morning and started to do something, and I pretty much did it on and off most all of the day, and I wanted to share it with you. I heard the phrase, practice gratitude, practice gratitude, and it kind of stuck with me, and I've been thinking about it, mulling it over in my mind for a couple of days, and I realized this morning that gratitude is just a habit like anything else. And someone made a comment in the comment section about some beauty routine I did, and they said, well, it's just a habit. And that is exactly right. I am a creature of habit, and I find that it's easier just to develop habits. So what I decided to do today was to practice gratitude as much as I could do all day long today. And I would say I kept my mind on that mission maybe 50% of the time, which my mind does tend to wander, so I was happy about that. And so basically, from the minute I put my feet on the floor, I thought, this is the day that the Lord hath made, let us rejoice and be glad in it. This is the day that the Lord hath made, let us rejoice and be glad in it. And no matter what your religion is or is not, that is good advice to help you live a happier life. And here's how it worked. Basically, I got out of bed and I said, thank you, bed. I'm so happy I had a nice warm bed to sleep in. I took a shower. I thanked the nice hot water and I realized that not everyone in the world has that advantage. And as I was driving to work, I felt gratitude that I have a job to do that brings in money. So friends, just for today, let's realize that gratitude is a habit like everything else and that really we should try to practice gratitude on a moment by moment basis because when we do that, we stop taking things and people for granted and we are grateful for them and happy. Take care and I'll see you in my next video.